Hey friends, it's Trucker Ray here with an update. Just outside of Kingman, Arizona. We're at the Petro. And we weren't going to stop here tonight, but the reason why we did is because Dale over here ended up having an issue with his... One of his coolant lines started leaking on him and derated him right on the highway on the 40. So we found this place here to get him over here. He we put a little bit of coolant in and he made his way here. <coughs> Excuse me. And uh, yeah, we popped his head and we found out that there was a hose like really loose at a point where you can almost spin it off. with You could spin it off with your hand. Just ridiculous that they don't tighten these things up when they when they assemble a truck it's just ridiculous if you guys start with a new company and they're and they or a company and they want to give you a brand new truck go over it with a fine tooth comb and make sure things are tight ah, just just ridiculous i'll tell you one thing if i get into a new truck anytime soon i don't know when that'll be maybe next year who knows i will be going over it with a wrench <laughs> it's just oh it's just ridiculous so we were going to get like two hours extra. I mean, what, what do we got there? We got two hours left of our drive day and it's like, who cares? We're going to, we're going to just do our thing here. Um, we got six and a half, six hours of driving tomorrow to do till we get to Nogales in uh, Arizona. Well, we are in Arizona, but you know what I mean? We won't be going over the border tomorrow. We'll be doing that on Tuesday into Nogales. And uh, yeah, so anyway, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, so we decided to uh, stop a little prematurely today because uh, his issue. And we figured, well, we think we got it fixed. It's, it's not leaking anymore. His le levels are cool, uh, topped up again. We got things tightened down. We were both looking at it and figuring, you know, trying to get this thing fixed without having to get a repair guy here. Save the company a little bit of money. I think we did. So, yeah, we got her done, Dale. And uh, you'll see all the details of all of that on the next coming video, which I am shooting as we make our way down to Nogales because it's my first time to Nogales, Mexico. And I know you guys want to see that. Um, thank you again for your comments on the new graphics, the 60 frames a second. Most of you, most of you. Uh, notice the changes and you like it a lot and we can tell that by the poll numbers uh, one person did say you should mention that there were some changes i did <laughs> go back and look at the poll you'll see 60 frames per second which is an m which is an up from 24 frames a second and the new graphics which you can obviously see so i'm glad you guys like that i will make it a point to do that on all the future videos all right, so that's all I got for you guys tonight. We are here in Kingman, Arizona, as I said. And uh, we're just going to relax for the rest of the night. And uh, maybe even work on a little bit of the video that we're working on right now. Or that we're shooting right now. And uh, we'll go from there. Anyway, that's all I got for you guys. Trucker Ray with an update from Kingman, Arizona. As we settle in for the night.